What's up, my friends? Another uh, interesting piece here I wanted to share with you guys, originally reported by the Courthouse News and uh, Adam Klasfeld, as you see here. And it's talking about the NDAA that I've covered so extensively in the past and recently, especially on my site, The Exalted Truth. And it says here in the title that a U.S. judge has blocked Obama's fascist NDAA indefinite detention law. And if you remember, I had been talking a lot about uh, how recently certain states uh, uh, tried to stand up against this. And I, I can't remember them offhand. I think it was Vermont. And um, uh, there were others, if I'm not mistaken. However, uh, th this particular article goes on to say here that a federal judge granted a preliminary injunction late Wednesday to block provisions of the 2012 National Defense and Authorization Act that would allow the military to indefinitely detain anyone it accuses of knowingly or unknowingly supporting terrorism. Signed by President Barack Obama on New Year's Eve, the 565-page NDAA contains a short paragraph in Statute uh, uh, 1021 letting the military detain anyone it suspects substantially supported al-Qaeda or al-Qaeda, the Taliban, or associated forces. Well, if you remember not too long ago, in one of my recent World War III scenario reports, uh, they, they had come out publicly saying that they were, they were going to work with the Taliban. And, I mean, you've heard many other people tell, talking about how al-Qaeda is actually a CIA creation, uh, and that's why a lot of people have given it the nickname al Uh However, it goes on to mention here that the indefinite detention would supposedly last until the end of hostilities. In a 68-page ruling blocking the statute, uh, U.S. District Judge Catherine Forrest Way to go, Catherine. So thought I'd throw that in there. Agreed that the uh, statute failed to pass constitutional muster because its broad language could be used to quash political dissent. A and, I mean, we all know what's really going on here, but, you know, I'm not going to rant on it right now. I'll scroll through here for those of you who wish to read it in its entirety and don't want to click a link. So you can go ahead and just pause it. Uh, but uh, I'll also, as usual, go ahead and link you guys, uh, uh, link you guys below to the article. So much love, my friends. And uh, apparently we got another judge standing up to uh, this fascist uh, detention law, as it's uh, called here in the title.